after the FBI investigation into fake allergy tests targeting hundreds of Tampa Bay families. They ended up with their personal information stolen, and that's not all. Consumer reporter Jackie Calloway tonight with their story. FBI agents raided this Atlanta office of Primera Medical Group in February. Now federal prosecutors last month charging CEO Shukathari and another top executive with health care fraud, targeting hundreds right here in Tampa Bay. I was totally shocked about what was going on. Nikki Taft and her two sons who live in Pinellas County thought they were getting free allergy tests after getting a call from a local survey company. You know, somebody used us. Nikki and her children gave blood and all of their personal information. Later, she discovered her medical insurance paid Primera more than $7,000 for injections and treatments she said they never received. That's very disturbing. Who knows what else they could do with that information. ABC Action News has learned as many as 300 Hillsborough and Pinellas residents fell for the same pitch. But those are some pretty outrageous claims. Robert Caselli discovered his medical insurance paid out over three grand for allergy injections. He said never took place. You didn't but have any of this medical treatment on any of those dates? Negative, no. According to the U.S. Attorney's Office, Cathari and his co-defendant submitted more than 4,500 fraudulent claims for allergy treatments. The U.S. Attorney's Office telling us these defendants allegedly sought more than $8.5 million in insurance payments after submitting thousands of fraudulent claims. I'd like to see them do some time and have to pay for what they've done to all of us people. We reached out to Cathari's attorney for comment, but are still waiting to hear back. I'm consumer investigator Jackie Calloway, taking action for you.